Hello everyone, this is Cliff. Welcome back to our Let's Play of Dark Souls to Prepare to Die Edition. Now, I had a kind of a big crash with Fraps. Uh, so let me walk you kind of backwards through what I just uh, what I just did. Uh, and again, I'm sorry. Uh, but let me show you first. Uh, we actually have the Cleansing Great Shield. This is the item that uh, is protecting Sif. Uh, so let me show you where we got this. Um, let's see, I, I don't nearly have the requirements for that. Okay, so basically uh, we went through, we kind of did the Chasm of the Abyss in the shortest way possible. Um, let's see, we unlock this shortcut right here, which I'm going to take back down just to show you where we were at. Alright, uh, everything gets real, real dark, and in here you face these humanity phantoms here. And, uh, they basically attack you by running into you. Um... So basically, once you you drop off a ledge and you run along here, let me see if I can get back to where I was. All right, come on. Basically, we drop off this ledge, and most of the time, there are uh, little markers up there, uh, sunstone guiders, and you just drop down in here, and you'll see Alvina, who we'll meet a little bit later. If you follow her, you basically have to kill one humanity demon right there. Um, there's three more in this other area where I was at. Let me move my mouse where it won't make the screen jump. right here and these guys aren't too bad uh, unless they do that see I accidentally pulled both of those so at this point we're just gonna burn them and the medium sized ones aren't two hits so they're pretty much gone now the biggest thing I can see when it comes to fighting these guys is to me it's very difficult to kinda tell when they're in range uh, for melee uh, so once you take those two guys out, uh, what you'll notice is this. Alvina will appear two or three times, and then the last time she appears will be right here. You break the illusory wall, and you come through here. And I think all of these humanity demons are one-off enemies. But anyway, uh, once you kill, there's, uh, there's five. Once you kill them, Sif is right in here. He will howl and leave behind the Great Shield. So, we have basically accomplished uh, everything we wanted to in the additional content for now. Um, I really don't think I'm going to... I just don't think I'm going to do any more of the new content, additional content right now. I think I'm going to come back a little bit later when I've got better, uh, better stats and uh, maybe can wield some a uh, little bit better equipment but basically this unlocks uh, this elevator back up to the royal wood um, so let's run back to our bonfire and along the way we'll go over the next video um, basically the next video we will be back at uh, dark root garden we're going to join Alvina's covenant temporarily for two reasons. Uh, the first reason is that there are a bunch of enemies that uh, are, they're kind of like phantom players. And I know you've seen, uh, if you played the game or when watching me play through the game, you've seen uh, kind of outlines of other people who are uh, playing the game. 
you'll actually face enemies that look like that and have kind of basic loadouts for uh, the different kind of archetypes, uh, thief, uh, warrior, uh, cleric, whatever. Um, we don't want to fight a whole lot of those guys because they just keep coming back and it is a lot easier to grab a couple of items. Um, I shouldn't have rested here with all these stupid things talking. Let's move back. Um, so we're going to grab a couple of the items uh, from joining the Forest Covenant. That's the first thing so that we don't get constantly harassed every time we go through that area. The second thing is it actually unlocks a merchant that will appear in Blight Town, and he will allow me to buy another Uchi Katana. And I think for that Uchi Katana, I'm going to make a Divine Uchi Katana uh, to help with the one of the areas coming up after after we go back to New Londo Ruins and after I fight the Four Kings, and that's probably going to be three or four videos down the line. Uh, but anyway, I'm sorry for the recording glitch up. Uh, but basically, uh, the only thing you missed was a uh, little uh, me killing five humanities and uh, Sif howling. All right, so uh, next time we speak, we'll be back in familiar territory. And I may at some point come back and take try to take on that dragon or come back and face manis but i think what i want to do before i before i do any of that is actually have some sort of light source because the chasm of the abyss is just frankly quite dark and i can't really see where i'm going so uh, until next time this is cliff and i will see you next i'll see you later take care